Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Janet, the Journal Keeper. Welcome back if you're a regular viewer and if you're new to this channel, I hope you'll enjoy what you see here and consider uh, um, subscribing and giving me a thumbs up. Uh, today is part four of our Edith Holden Ringbound Journal, the work we're doing on that. Um, today's is going to be a little bit shorter. The reason being is I have uh, the work on my studio is starting earlier than planned. And um, so I've had to do a lot of clearing out and moving around. So I can't really do uh, the whole um, video as planned. I have been working a little bit on on the uh, journal. Uh, so I, what I'm going to do is show you uh, what I've done. And then there may be a break before the next video to uh, finish it up. So I'm not sure how long the break will be. It depends how long the work takes because it's got to be a foundation dug and, and all that. So it could be a while, you know, I may, if I, if I manage to finish it inside, um, I may do a flip through. Um, if I can do that, I, I will. Um, I wanted to show you this very old book. I'm not sure of the date because it doesn't have a date that I found in our church, uh, in the choir stalls. Unfortunately, we don't have a choir anymore. Uh, we have old pictures up of of the choir and and children in the choir, and this is the chants for the choir during the services, uh, all the different services. And I asked if I could have it because obviously it hasn't been used in years, uh, and I was told I could. So I'm, I think I'm thinking of a project to make this into a prayer journal. Uh, the prayer journals I had on sale in my Etsy shop have sold, so I would like to have another one. Uh, in there so I'm thinking that maybe a prayer journal might be what we make out of that so as you can see I have put some eyelets in um, some of that has not been hugely successful and I'm going to have to strengthen some of the pages um, last week we did collage and we did some uh, stenciling around the journal pages. Uh, you can see I've put eyelets here. Some pages that seems to have worked out well. Others it hasn't worked out so well. Um, I've put some lace here. Um, I've been made a start on making some tags and journal cards. I've made a start, only a very basic start, on a little notebook to go in inside here. It's going to be, um, I think that's, is that, that lovely dog roses? Yes, and that's going to be some uh, of pale pink paper that I used. Um, oh, what did I use on that? It wasn't the red cabbage because that's a bluey colour. It was... Um, I can't remember. Something I boiled up and then <laughs> um, used as a dye. Uh, anyway, they're a pale pink paper. They'll be um, probably stapled in and then there'll be some decoration in there. Just going to be a plain little notebook. And here I've put some lace here and made, I, I had a book of Edith Holden postcards and I've backed them with some cream cardstock and sewn around those. Uh, I'm not sure that I've done anything much on these. I was going to put a bit of lace on there, but it's a, uh, I haven't done that yet. I made a card, a uh, journal card for that. Uh, oh, yes, I think we had put some um, 
book pages on here, but I, I have added this little bit here. Uh, and here is a journal card, just two lots of card and some collage there. Um, this one, uh, I think I've added this to, after we collaged here, I've added this irises and made a journal card for that. Um, this one, I uh, made a little pocket here out of calico, which has been stamped on. I can't remember. It's a Tim Holtz stamp set. I'll, I'll list that in the um, description. Uh, these are made by Carolan of CAJ Crafts. She has a YouTube channel and an Etsy shop of the same name. And she has lots of um, decorative items for sale. Uh, in here, I've made a card for the see-through pocket there. And this is another postcard, which I've added again, the cream card and sewn around there. Done a little bit more on there, added the um, flowers there. I'm not sure if that's complete. I might do something else to it. All right, right. Again, another postcard made into a journal card. Um, and this is the flip out journaling page uh, place there. Um, this one is a fold out with some journaling space and there was a um, uh, a crease down this page so I put a belly band in there and put a little cord and some lace on that so, and that's the back cover so so for now um, that's it and um, it may just be a flip through at the end so sorry that's all sort of gone a bit wrong because um, I can't really put the man off because I've finally found someone that can do the work for me so it's going to have to go ahead. So I'm hoping that I'll see you in the not too distant future and I hope you'll all stay well and safe and bye for now.